Got a new haircut and look at him he's so cute he's like patiently waiting to go outside he just finished his bacon chip you want to go outside let's go come on let's go look how excited he gets guys super cute ready set go this is what i usually give him it's one of the bacon strips and he loves these look at him I want to show you guys what I got for him. I got him a, a car seat. I got a new car and I want to keep it looking brand new. Right, Chip? Right? It's currently 11.47 a.m. I, I was actually up pretty early today. I got up around 4 o'clock. I've had like two cups of coffee. Tomorrow, I'm going to go get the rims for my car. I've actually waited on these rims for about a month already. I went and bought some rims like the week after I got my car because I went to Vegas. Okay, so I bought my car and, like two days later. I flew out to Vegas, came back, and then wait, hold on. Okay, so so I bought my car, I went to Vegas, I came back, and then I bought some rims. Now I've been waiting for a month and it feels like forever because the month is like pretty much almost over. So I also want to show you guys the new Versace slides that I just purchased. They're so freaking cute. They're pink with studs. I'll show you them when I get to it. I'm about to like do my hair a little bit. Just straighten it because it's pretty insane looking. Alrighty, so my hair is all done. Nice and straight. I just went and got my hair touched up last week. Um, It's like very subtle. I wish it was more like on the drastic side, but my friend said that um, she did it this way so that when it grows out, it looks more, it doesn't look too harsh, I guess. This is what it looks like. It's freaking bomb, you guys. Like when I wear them, they sparkle. I'm actually going over the footage and I came across this part and yeah, it just brings back like that day so well. Like. Oh. It was tight. I wish I could go back and relive that day again. We don't care how much it cost. It's just the fact that I was just out and doing whatever I wanted with no restrictions. Nobody knew who I was. That feeling of just getting away was awesome. Okay, so I've already edited a picture and um, put in all the words and stuff. So I went over my comments on my YouTube. Seeing that there was a few people that always leave me comments and thank you. I appreciate all the love that you guys give and all the support you show. Yeah, there's one particular subby that always talks about like my wedding stuff, which is pretty funny because um, my fiance actually gave me the go that I can like, you know, start looking up some stuff. You know how you only get married once in a lifetime? We actually want to go all out and, you know, throw the a big wedding not not the biggest wedding but we want to throw a big wedding what i'm trying to say is i have been looking up like wedding dresses i've actually looked up a couple of venues and we have a couple of like spots that we're looking at but there's this one that i am freaking in love with but because it's only a year away there's no need to have a wedding planner you know so anyways let me show you guys okay so this is the dress that I'm actually like looking at. You guys, this dress is to die. Come on, focus. Anyways, you guys can kind of get the idea. Like that, and it's embellished all around the booby part and it goes down to the waist. He said I could pick any kind of dress I want and this is the one. Hopefully I can find a shop that carries something similar to that or maybe they can order it and then, you know, I could try it on. The back part, it drapes like this. It's so freaking pretty you guys so for the venue I've been looking at this one it's called the Empress Estate and it's about a two-hour drive from here but you know so it is only gonna happen you know once in a lifetime why not choose the bomb ass place I mean I could choose a place here in Seattle but you know what are you gonna get a restaurant and then like what else is there a hotel ballroom 
I don't really want to do that. I want to just do it at a really nice place. Who knows? I might change my mind within a year or something. But this is what I've been looking at. Let me go back. It's a mansion, you guys. It's freaking beautiful. So we'll do the wedding and stuff outside. And hopefully it's nice, you know. Look at that. Who doesn't want a wedding like that? Hello. I wish I could show you guys a clearer picture, but... Man, I don't know how to use the camera yet. Shit. Hopefully I can lose like 30 pounds by then. For my dress, he said I could pick something around like up to 2,000 or 3,000. So I'm like, shit, <laughs> Cool. Because most of the dresses I've seen, they're like 500. So 2,000, they're like, they better be the bomb, bitch. He can't have a regular tuxedo. He needs to have like a white one. And he, I, I don't know. I want him to have a certain haircut. I, I already have everything imaged in my head. I'm just like, I'm just ready for the day. Yeah. Looking at wedding stuff, it, it gets me like hella excited and I don't know, I thought I'd share that with you guys. Mm -hmm. Still calling, show me what I showed you, you ain't even my girl, did you just how you like it? Where editing videos make me feel so freaking tired and that is why I always pick up a cup of Starbucks before I head home because if I don't have a cup of coffee before I start editing, my ass is just like straight up gonna go to sleep. Like, I cannot fucking hang. My house is dirty though, so I can't show you this. I went to TJ Maxx and I picked this up for Chip. So yeah, I thought it'd be pretty cute. Like, he could just chill in the basket, you know? I got this picture frame. I thought it was dope. This organic traditions turmeric powder. Heard it's really good for digestion and inflammatory stuff. Right, you like it? You like it, boy? So I will be doing new car tour tomorrow and I can't wait to show you guys my car. It's so freaking bomb. You just want to pee because you think all the dogs are there or something. Oh my god, this guy is so negative. Like every day, every morning, every night. Yeah, your dog is just hella weird. Our dog? <laughs> it's our dog. Why does he keep saying it's my dog? It's your dog. It's not my dog. It's our dog. Right, Chip? You're our dog. Right? I think he's gay. It's cool. Hey, why would you say that about a dog? Don't be talking about Chip. He gets bitches. Yeah, your dog broke. He's cute. Right, Chip? You cute? Chip, look at me. You hungry or you thirsty? Which one? Damn, chill out, birds. No? Oh. Oh. He tried to jump. Oh. He's fine, right? Come on. My dog is hella special, you guys. He got his foot stuck in the bench when he tried to jump off. Chip, how you feeling? You okay? Chip? <laughs> Whoa! What the fuck are you doing? You dumbass bitch. Fuck. So worried about your parking spot, you fucking dumb. We're home. I'm tired. You tired, babe? Thanks for driving. 